Hmm. Can't quite make the dialect out. Possible. I can't carry any more. Lara, I think I have one of those stone things here. I've got the others. Now what? Now we put them together and see what your grandmother is trying to tell you. Bilad understood Grandma better than anyone. Meet me at her place. Pull up. Can't carry any more. I can hear them calling from under the earth. The voices. The old gods. Maybe you just need to rest. No. See for yourself. See where the breath of the gods rises from the womb of the earth. Listen to their pained howls. I haven't noticed that. Where is this breath? You'll see. You'll hear it. Perhaps you can ease their suffering. You should talk to Abigail. She insists on meeting all the newcomers. You mean Abby? We've met. She's been very helpful. Ah, that's our Abigail. Always ready to fix a generator or stop an argument. She's our de facto mayor, unofficial general store owner, half of the volunteer fire department. And trust me, you don't want to get into a fist fight with her. I wonder how she gets all that on her business card. Uh... Okay, well, uh, good luck with everything. Oh, 
Always nice to see fresh faces in town. Good for the mind to know that our little corner of the world isn't forgotten. Also good for the wallet, if you'd maybe take a look at what we have for sale up at the general store. Ah, uh, I was hoping Abigail would be with you. She's on her way. Hi, auntie. Ah. <sighs> uh. It's been too long, child. Oh, let me look at you. Mm, still with the short hair, I see. <clears throat> Auntie, we found something in Grandma's map. Actually, your hair could be better too, now that I see you again. The pair of you are like tomboys out chasing after. Auntie, please. Why did Grandma want me to have the map? I deserve to know. Hmm. Do you remember the stories your grandmother used to tell you as a child? About a magical, hidden place built by your ancestors? Yes, but I grew up and she grew old and nothing magical ever happened. But she didn't forget her promise. It's there, in your hands. Why now? Ah, I'm only the custodian of the map. It's up to you to discover its purpose. Abby, I'm sure whatever is revealed in this map will lead to that hidden place and your answers. <laughs> I hope so. All right, let's take a look. If we place each one of the fragments on the map where they were found, like so... That's the Chakana, the Inca Cross. It represents the three levels of existence. The upper world, the middle world, our world, and the underworld. It also represents the things that make us human. Like the ability to love, to take action, to gain wisdom. But if I'm remembering correctly, the center of the Chakana is said to represent Cusco, the capital of the Inca Empire. In the context of the map, we're hundreds of miles from there. Well, there are many interpretations of the Chakana. Uh, Cusco, um, a portal from one world to the next. It is also said to be the eye of God, a guardian keeping watch over us all. So, what are we looking for? I mean, this has to point to something, right? Let's take a closer look. There has to be something we're not seeing. Something... There! I thought it was a small blemish when I first saw it, but in this light, it looks like a Maya hieroglyph. Maya? That doesn't make any sense. We are Inca. What does it say? Hahil. It means truth. Truth? Truth about what? I don't know. Does this place on the map mean anything to you? Grandma and I would sit there when she told me stories about the hidden place. <laughs> Perhaps you'll find your answers there. Are you ready? Keep the map. I'll meet you there. Hello, primates. Gorilla Kill sells products to pay the bills. Support and treat yourself to quality items like this so he can keep bringing you wild videos like this one. And remember, alone we are weak, apes together strong.
Abby, keep your radio close. I'll stay in touch if I find anything. Sounds good. And watch your ass in there. You can count on that. Need to open the gate. way to get across. This architecture is definitely m <laughs> Looks like this bridge works like the last one. Swing that pendulum over here. Got to be a way to swing that pendulum over here. The wall behind this pendulum could be climbed. If I had to guess, I'd say this place is a massive forge. But on this scale... What would they be forging that would require this kind of heat? The Sorry, wall behind this pendulum be could be climbed. must work like the others. Gonna be quite the climb. There are statues here. Huge faces arranged in a circle around the central column. They're watching over it like sentinels. What are they guarding? You have a view that I don't. Now I kind of wish I came with you. These platforms look just like those bridges.
right way. got your grandmother's journal here. It's... she's written to you. You'll want to look like a place to cross. I, you... you can't leave me hanging like that. Go on, what's it say? The short of it? You're a descendant of the Maya Queen Abarane on your grandmother's side. You're the latest in a long line of protectors that... What? Queen Abarane? Grandma is related to a Maya Queen? Wait, I'm related to a Maya queen. <laughs> yes. You're a guardian. All the gas clouds what are visible from here. I, I'm not even Maya. I... This day has gotten way too heavy. Bilar's got a lot of explaining to do. Abby, I found a mural depicting a great journey. A Maya queen leading thousands of her people from Mexico to Peru. Why did she lead them here? That's too easy. There are many theories about what happened to the Maya. There are old favorites. Invasion, civil war, collapsing cities. But one theory has become very popular. That the Maya civilization was ultimately doomed by a period of severe climate change. She was completely out of a decades-long drought. So, where'd they all go? There's a sarcophagus here. It's beautiful. Definitely royalty. A sarcophagus? Like a coffin? Exactly like a coffin. I thought it was a forge. Whoever is buried here, they were very closely tied to this place and its purpose. have enough space for that. hidden place it was a forge but something more as well yes it is the resting place of the maya queen abarane the first guardian of kuakyaku she built the forge to construct an artifact of great power what artifact uh, i don't know Mariana told me that what was born from that place had long been lost. But she said the message it contained would always endure. It was a message of hope for the future. 
If you knew about all this, why wouldn't you tell me? I'm sorry, but I made a promise to Mariana. So what? I'm supposed to accept that I'm Maya all of a sudden? Abarrane's bloodline has been diluted over the centuries, but you are descended from her. So what does this mean? You're a guardian, Abigail. Like Mariana and her mother before her, all the way back to the time of Abarrane. <laughs> I can't be a guardian. I have responsibilities here. I've... You've been protecting this village for years. Hasn't a little bit of you always known? Felt, compelled, somehow. You are the keeper of the story now. That's what Grandma used to say. She said it was her job to keep its story, to keep it safe. She promised that one day she would show me where it was, and then I'd be the keeper of its story. She didn't forget her promise. She just had a different way of showing you. It's so like her, isn't it? She couldn't just tell me. Had to make a treasure hunt out of it. <sighs> I loved your grandmother as if she was my own sister. But sometimes she was a gigantic pain in the ass. Abby, I think I'll leave you two alone to talk about things. Sounds like you've got some catching up to do. Thanks, Lara. Here, I want you to have this for all your help. And before you say anything, it's customary, so you kind of can't say no. Thank you. Hey guys, this is Gorilla Kills from Gorilla Gaming, and this is what my face looks like. Sorry if you're disappointed. You're probably wondering why is my dumb face on your screen instead of the video just clicked on. I know, I'll be quick. Tired of being tracked? Or maybe you're just tired of getting those notices from your internet provider. Or maybe you're trying to watch a video on Netflix and it's not available in the region. Whatever the case may be, you need a VPN. ExpressVPN is the best VPN on the market. Click the link down below. I love making these videos for you guys. And if you want to support me so I can keep bringing great content like this, click that link down below. And most importantly, protect yourself, guys. You need this VPN. Let's get back to the game.